My friends, how are you? Welcome back to this channel. Covering again on something that is trending on the internet. Something that shows the world in which we live today. You see music uh, that um, belongs to Twilight Zone. Because the world in which we live today is a redefined world. It's a world that pushes traditional values away. Or at least they try to do it. At least the Western world. Because Africa, Eastern Europe, they still stick, parts of Asia, they still stick to traditional values. But the world, the Western world, the so-called uh, civilized, uh, powerful, industrialized, that uh, experienced um, a booming of uh, financial blessings, it's embracing a new reality. A new reality. I'm going to show you a video that you already know on the music again of White Bart Audio Carl Casey a music that uh, makes us feel that we are in Twilight Zone and sometimes it seems that we are in Twilight Zone isn't it? don't you feel sometimes when you open your TV and then the mainstream media is bombarding you with the new reality that they want to give to you they want to make you believe in their new reality and then uh, you go on the internet and you see Associated Press, BBC, and everything mainstream, they push on you their new reality. But we, as Christians, as children of God, we don't have to believe, isn't it? You don't have to say it here loud and clear, but you know what you have to believe. So, uh, I want to show you a video. A video that belongs to the new reality. Ricky Coley is the first transgender to win, to become a Miss Netherlands and Netherlands gonna use Ricky as a competitor in a Miss Universe. Let's see a little bit of video. We're gonna pause the music. And we're gonna go and see this video. It's not much to see, but um, it will speak a lot. Miss Nidos. So, uh, three and two and one. Let's go. Miss Nederland 2023 is Ricky. That's the video, mm, that's the video, and um, I don't know, um, let's put the music back. <laughs> To comment here much I don't want to but I want to allow you to comment here you have to be smart <laughs> you have to say what you have to say but in a way that uh, will be the best way to say it <laughs> so that's what I'm saying it lots of saying it seems that now I have a, a key word to say to be as uh, vocal as it's possible I'm just wondering one little question. Was this a uh, competition fair? I mean, uh, the other competitors. They were extremely beautiful, weren't they? Now, uh, Ricky. Was Ricky the most beautiful? I don't know. I think not. Me personally, I think not. But I know, in a, let's put a, aside uh, some realities about who Ricky is. But let's just see it um, in a more general way. 
this contest that I'm not a fan of, I'm a Christian and I do not touch people according to how they look external. I have two daughters. I will never push them to be a part of this kind of... Uh, you display yourself in front of some people and those people, uh, not sure how much uh, objective they are, they decide who's more beautiful. I don't see it this way. But now, uh, to speak the language of those that like to see this displays of, uh, I don't know, flesh. Was Ricky the most beautiful there? Was Ricky the most um, attractive there? I don't think so. What about you? What do you think? And I'll lead me myself to this kind of uh, approach. God bless you all, thank you so much, and uh, we live in a very, very sad world. This new reality is a very sad reality. I worry for our children. God bless you all. Stay close to God.